Welcome to the Living Healthy with COPD YouTube channel. Subscribe to get daily videos. Also hit the notification bell and if you like the video, hit the like button. We make videos all about what it is like to live with COPD. The topics range from supplements, diet, exercise, spirituality, medications, and overall healthy lifestyle. Enjoy. COPD, eat right at every bite. Eating right may help boost your energy when you have COPD. If you're losing a lot of weight, a few comfort foods may return to your diet. Breathing burns 10 times more calories when you have COPD. For people who are watching their weight, smaller portions of the nutrient-packed foods in this slideshow will keep calories in check and provide the fuel your body needs to help you feel your best. Eat more often. If you find yourself getting fatigued while you eat, or you have trouble breathing because you get too full, try eating smaller meals more often. Four to six small meals during the day, instead of three large meals, will keep you from getting overly full. It also will require less energy to eat. That means you'll be less fatigued and better able to get what you need from the food you eat. Also, relax and rest before you eat. A COPD breakfast. Breakfast may be your most important meal. A lot of people with COPD get too fatigued later in the day to eat well. If that sounds familiar, try to have your largest meals early in the day, when you have the most energy. And since you should be getting 25 to 30 grams of fiber every day, starting with a bowl of bran cereal and whole wheat toast gets you headed in the right direction. Eat more nutritious foods first. If fatigue is making you stop eating before you get the calories and nutrients you need, eat the high calorie items first. But don't go for the empty calories of mashed potatoes or desserts. Sink your fork into chicken, lean beef, baked fish, or tofu so you get protein with every bite. Say cheese. Adding cheese to dishes like potatoes, rice, or vegetables will increase both the nutrient value and the caloric value of any meal. Plus you'll get extra calcium to help protect your bones, which can be made brittle by some of the medicines prescribed for COPD. When you want the nutrients in cheese at a lower calorie count, look for those labeled part skim or reduced fat. Drink plenty of fluids. Drinking plenty of non-caffeinated fluids will help keep the mucus in your airways thin and make it easier to clear your lungs. At mealtimes, eat first and sip later. That way you won't feel full before you've had a chance to get a solid, nutritious meal. Milk, please. If you need to gain weight, your body can make good use of the calories in milk, while the calcium and vitamin D help keep your bones strong. Try drinking it in place of water throughout the day. Avoid caffeine. Caffeine is not a good choice for someone with COPD. It can interfere with some medicines and may cause nervousness and restlessness, which can exacerbate your symptoms. So avoid all emit coffee, tea, and caffeinated sodas. And yes, unfortunately, the caffeine in chocolate lands it on the no-no list. Get more fiber. Because you're unlikely to get all of the 25 to 30 grams of fiber you need each day from breakfast alone, include high fiber foods in your other meals. A bowl of low sodium split pea. 